Most Photoshop tools have their own keyboard shortcut. If you hover over that tool, the tooltip will tell you what it is. For example, I for the eyedropper tool, B for the brush tool, and E for the eraser tool. So notice I'm currently using the move tool. Now if I tap the B key, it will jump me to the brush tool. So if I just click and hold out here, I can paint on the canvas like so. So it's now time to sample a new color. I will tap the I key to give me the eyedropper tool, sample my color, tap in the B key again to jump back to the brush tool, and I'll continue painting like so. So the keyboard shortcuts are great for jumping to tools, but of course, if you're having to do this a lot, it can become a little cumbersome. So I'd like to show you a way to speed this up, and that's using a feature known as spring loaded keys. So again, we can see I'm using the brush tool and I'm painting with blue. Now, instead of just tapping the I key to jump me to the eyedropper tool, I'm going to click and hold on the I key. So notice I'm now in the eyedropper mode just here. I'll sample a color and only now will I release the I key. As soon as I do that, it will return me to whatever tool I was using, in this case, the brush tool. So now I can come down here and continue painting. Let me show you that again. So we're painting away here with the brush tool in green, holding down the I key. It temporarily gives me the eyedropper tool. I'll come up here, sample my color, release the I key now. It returns me to the brush tool and I can continue painting like so. I'll quickly show you a second variation of this here, guys. So if we tap the E key, it jumps me to the eraser tool. Of course, I then tap the B key to get me back to the brush tool. But like before, let's temporarily invoke the eraser tool. So I'm using the brush tool. If I click and hold on the E key, I can erase those pixels like so. And as soon as I release the E key, it will return me to the brush tool and I can continue painting like so. So that's the spring-loaded keys here inside of Photoshop. I hope that helps speed things up for you. Catch you later.